One of my uh, missions in this life is to try to bring us together as real brothers. Last spring, six members of Congress went to Russia to learn more about the brothers accused of the Boston Marathon bombings. They brought along action star Steven Seagal, a friend of Russian President Vladimir Putin, to serve as a diplomatic liaison. As an American, was trying to do the best I could <clears throat> for what I believe in. And what I believe is that Russia is an extremely important ally and that the Cold War is over and that we, meaning America, should really have an open mind and an open heart in terms of uh, trying to create closer and closer, better diplomatic relations with Russia. He's a covert agent trained to survive in Vietnam. The seventh degree black belt is best known for his roles in action films like Above the Law and Under Siege. The cook from Under Siege is back. Beyond taking down bad guys on the big screen, he does it in real life as a reserve deputy sheriff. It's all captured in his reality TV series, Steven Seagal, Lawman. Now in its third season, Seagal is taking his police work to Arizona. He's partnered with the infamous Sheriff Joe Arpaio. As the top law enforcement officer in Maricopa County, Arpaio has been criticized over jail conditions and alleged racial profiling. We, you know, hunt the bad guys down and we arrest them. And, you know, uh, over here they're always trying to make these innuendos that Joe Arpaio is a racist and he racially profiles and he hates Mexicans. And it's hilarious because 99% of the guys on my team are Mexican. and. Most of the people we arrest are not Mexican. We don't care if you're Chinese, Japanese, Filipino, German, Dutch. We don't care. If you break the law and we catch you, we arrest you. When he's not putting up a fight, he's finding his Zen. Seagal tells us how Buddhism shapes his worldview. What's important is to look into the nature of your mind and find out how we as human beings can help each other, how we as human beings can be uh, uh, more thoughtful, really practice altruism, be more compassionate, and try to make the world a better place. There have been rumors of Seagal running for governor of Arizona. We asked him to set the record straight on his political ambitions. A lot of people who ask me to do it, and it may be an arrogant thing to say, but I think if I do run or did run, I would have a real good shot at winning. The problem is, um, at this point in time, I, I'm, I don't think I qualify because I've only been in Arizona for four years, and I think you need a five-year residency. So there's a lot of little things going on, but we may run for governor another time. So he's not ruling out that governorship for the future. But for now, we'll have to wait and see if his diplomatic efforts pay off. In Scottsdale, Arizona, Liz Wall, RT.